Who what's up people, Dr. Wolves Trades here and welcome to the final Yu-Gi-Oh! pack of ring of the month. Yes, my birthday wishes from Yu-Gi-Oh! have been absolutely amazing, but we're ending it off with one of the best sets that came out last year. Came out beginning of November. The 25th anniversary Rarity Collection. It's my first time opening up the booster box with you guys. I hopefully will buy some more in the future. To open up in the future as well with you guys because this set is absolutely amazing what is in this set if you guys want to know there is 79 cards in the set there was originally 80 in japan what is the missing card it is max c it really hurts me to tell this very day i really wanted max c more than anything but doesn't really matter 79 is better than like let's say 25 of them all cards can be any rarity from the lowest rarity to super rare to the highest rarity which is the quarter of a century rare there are new rarity versions the ultimate rares are back but as the japanese versions the collector's rares are back which are in the japanese version which is even better and the freaking quarter of a century secret rares but there is a set there's a rarity that has not come out since 2015 which is the platinum rare which is which is absolutely amazing i've been wanting that's that rarity to come back for so many years but it's finally in this set now what is actually in this set all the meta cards are in here you have ash blossom if you pull ash blossom as a quarter of a century rare it is worth 300 pounds not lying to you people look it up on ebay if you pull Baron de Fiora, the Adolf Hitler of Yu-Gi-Oh, he's worth 150. If you pull uh, evenly match, that's worth 50. You have yourself flipping triple tactics talent, which is worth 75. These cards are meta as shit, people, and they are playable. This is why people are paying stupid money for these booster boxes. These booster boxes retail for 130 pounds each. Luckily for me, thanks to Drew, I got these for 86 pounds each. I don't mind paying that. Either way, let's stop jibber jabbering. There's five cards in a pack, 24 packs all together. Wish me luck. I'm hoping to pull some Baron de Fiora's, some Ash Blossoms, and a lot of amazing cards. I am extremely excited for this, people, because this set is my all time favourite this year. No capping. Crack this open. There we go. Here we go, people. And it's all textured, the boost box as well. Very textured. Let's take the seal of approval off. And just let you guys know, in a boost box, you could you can get a minimum of three ultimates, three collectors, and three quarter centuries. You could potentially get more. There is God boxes out there that, are, that has a lot more than that. The most I've seen is four of each, so we could be very lucky. There is no trick in these booster boxes, it's just a matter of what you can get. Wish me luck. Remember people, quarter of a century, there's some amazing ones here. Let's have a look. First card we get is Dimensional... Um, Dimensional Barrier, super rare. We've got Ecclesia, what? Oh, we got Evening Star Secret. we got Blue Eyes Abyss Dragon. And we've got Downer Magician. So this pack that you saw here that has a secret rare, that is actually a bog standard ca card list, okay? That's bog standard. If you get something that's a platinum rare or an ultimate or a collector's or a quarter century, that's the good pack. So, get that prepared, people. Poison Wind. Afterglow. Oh, we got a Platinum Rare Summon Limit! That is such a great card! Neither players can summon more than two monsters per time. I've got a Small World. Oh, we get ourselves a freaking Collector's Rare! Freaking Nibiru! 
Oh my god! That is freaking awesome! That was actually a god pack right there. You got two cards in one. Oh my god, a collector's rare Nibiru. OMFG, that is awesome! Whoo! That is awesome. I'm putting them together like that. That is freaking awesome! I'm excited for this. But like I said, how many Ash Blossoms can I pull though? Because Ash Blossom is supposed to be the most hardest card to pull in this set, okay? So, get yourself prepared for that. Oh, there he is again, bowing the fuel sea kale! <laughs> Let's go! We get Adolf Hitler! Adolf Hitler, bowing the fuel, Let's go! And then we got ourselves Sword Soul and Reasonings as an Ultra. And Dark Wooler no more. Ooh, I'm slaving straight away Bowen de Fiora. I want so many Bowens, to be honest, people. Because I got a lot of them in Japanese. But I definitely do want them in English more than anything. Because people want them. And people would pay good money for them. We got Inspector Border. Nice. Masked Claw. And Effect Veiler. Nice. Secret. We got Poison Wind. And the Arch Light. Cool. Next pack. Lightning Storm Super Rare. That looks great. We got Fall of Albez. We got ourselves the Master of Magicians. A Ultimate Rare Junk Speeder. What? That looks mint. We haven't seen Junk Speeder in like God knows how many years. I think it was about 2018. And he was only a secret, but now he's an ultimate rare. The texture looks amazing. Very well done to him. And then we have Fossil Dig. Wow. And remember people, I'm only pricing up the um, very special cards. I'm not pricing up the secrets at all. I'm just pricing up the ones that is what everybody's after. We've got Mech Knight. Super. Hey, we got Haunted Mansion. We'll put her to the side. We got Ghost Trick Angel of Mischief. Secret. Harpy's Feather Storm. We haven't seen that in a long time either. And an Ultra Rare Mech Knight. Very good. We're sleeving up the Haunted Mansion, the Ghost Spell. Because that is a meta card for me. We got ourselves Mechanized Fusion. We got the Swamp. Oh, let's go! Triple Tactics Talents, a cross precision rare! That is a £75 card right there! Oh, let's go! Oh, that looks freaking mint! Oh my god, that is so good! And then we get Elvish of the Golden Lord. Oh my god, that's our first quarter of a century that we pulled now, people. Our first one. And it's one of the big hitters. That is good. It's not like, like Shadol's scheme or anything like that that I quite dirty cheap. This is an expensive one because everybody uses this card. Oh that's, oh, that's amazing. I feel good. My luck is on my side, people. My luck is on my side. I'm happy. We've got the Angel of a Burning Abyss as a super. Ancient Fairy Dragon. A Seeker Rare Dark Law. A ultra rare Baron de Fiora, let's go! And another barrier. Oh, we've got two Baron de Fioras, that is good. Whew. We're looking good, people, but no Ash Blossom. Not even as a super rare, she's not here. She must be hard to pull, definitely. Shadol Scheme. Ice Dragon Prism. Down a Magician. Harvest Feather Storm. And a Collector Danger Jackalope. I'll take that. That is nice. Definitely if you're into your dangers. That is actually a really cool card. I like that. That's the thing that's weird though. Why on earth did they choose Jackalope and they didn't choose anything like Nessie or Bigfoot? Because they're actually the best ones to get. In my eyes. Whew. We got Tri Brigade Revolt. We got Small World. We got Fossil Dig. Striker Dragon, really good link card. I think you're only limited to have one in the tournament. 
and a fusion. Okay. Next up, come on. We pulled one quarter of a century at the minute. We got Border. Call by the Grave. We got Nightmare Unicorn. And an ultimate rare vision here of fairies. Oh, that looks nice. And an Ash Blossom, let's go! <laughs> we get us an ultra rare, let's freaking go! We got one. I'm, I'm happy with one, either way, but we still got quite a bit of booster box left to go. But we got an ultimate rare Ferris. That is nice indeed. Whew! Oh yeah, baby, let's go. I'm happy. We got Chaos, Chaos Space. Change of Heart, nice. Long, uh, Lone Fire Blossom. It's a good plant monster there. Ferris again. And a Ghost Bell. The Pinnek, another one. Come on, this is looking really, really good, people. Really good. We've got Luna of the Fairy Tale. Ancient Fairy Dragon. Oh, a Platinum Rare Predator Plant. That's actually cool. Call by the Grave. A Nightmare Unicorn. Okay. That's one to definitely have. I have to double check with the actual ones I pulled recently that I've not sleeved up. Because I don't know if I missed any of them out. There he is. The Ring Dragon of Ra Sphere Mode. A, a big Kaiju. A big one. We've got the, the gay man himself. El Lich of the Golden Lord. Oh! A Platinum Rare Bow in the Fjord! <laughs> yes, my G! Oh, that was a mint! Oh, I can't believe it. Three Barons, three Baron of yours, and all three different rarities. I am happy! Woo! I'm going to take the rest of them out of the boost box now and put the boost box to the side. Because we've still got quite a few left, people. Oh, man, I can't believe this. This is freaking mint. Effect Veiler, Benty, Part of Extravagance of the Secret Rare, that looks nice! Junk Speeder, and uh, an Elder Lidge, I mean not Elder Lidge, um, an Ecclesia. Whew. We've still not pulled any more Quarter Centuries, I'm a bit worried, but I shouldn't be because you're guaranteed to get three. Revolt, Mood Maiden, Dark Ruler No More, Secret, nice. Chaos Space and a Lancer. Let's see what else have we got here. Evacuation Device. Now this is the card I don't want as a quarter of a century rare because I've already got it in Japanese and I don't want to get another one. Sword Soul. We got Soul Striker Dragon. Lightning Storm. Lovely. And a Pod Desires. Ooh, like it. We've not got a single uh, pot of pot prosperity yet either. But like I said though, there is 78 cards in this set, so 79, so there's a lot of them. Summon limit. God slime, love it. Ooh, spellbook of judgment, nice. Dog magic of punishment. And a forbidden droplet. Yeah boy. Love it. Absolutely love it. Oh, nice! We got ourselves the Time Thief Recorder. Down a Magician. No. Oh! God, oh, Cedric Magician Salvation! I'll have that! It's a Dark Magician card at the end of the day. I love it! That is such a nice one. And then we got Photon Dragon. And a freaking Ultimate Rare! Is it? No! It's not, it's a collector's rare, Numeron Dragon! Wah! That was a god pack and a half, jeez! That is such a great pack right there, people. Oh my god. Jeez Louise, we got some big hits, people, big hits. Unicorn, we've only pulled one 
Ash Blossom, that's the thing though, so they are hard to pull. Heat Soul, cool. Forbidden Drop as a secret, nice. No. Ooh, a collector's rare! Elder Entity! No way! Two! Two! A collector's rare down a magician! What? Oh my goodness! This is a godly box. This is very godly. Very godly. We got some god packs here because some very good god packs. And Down the Magician is such a great card too. Holy crap. Change of heart. We still got... We only pulled two quarter century rares though. So we're still looking for one more. Another Forbidden Droplet. Nice. A Secret Air Lightning Storm. Love it. Neuron Dragon. And an, inver and an inverter. Okay. Whew. Three packs left, people. Three packs left. We got the Elder. We got Blossom. We got a Haunted Mansion. Ooh. We got ourselves Ancient Fairy Dragon. And we got a Burning Abyss. Oh. It's getting intense now, people. It's getting very intense. Another one in my meta folder. We got ourselves Ecclesia. Afterglow. A secret red Nibiru, I'll take it. Red Eyes Flare Metal Dragon, love it. No! A Freaking ultra rare! Evacuation device. I said I didn't want it to be a quarter of a century, but I got it as an ultimate, so I'll take it either way. I'm happy. And uh, that seeker rare is definitely going into my meta binder. It's big time. Whew. We got a lot, lot of ultimates and collectors and collectors rares, but final pack of destiny. Could I only I've only pulled two quarter centuries? Or is it in this pack? Ferris, Infinite Impermanence, I'll take one. Heat Soul, Summon Limit, and a Pop Extravagance. Woo! That is actually really good. Infinite Impermanence definitely going home with me. Damn, loving that. To be honest, people, do I think I might want to buy another booster box of this? Possibly I will do, because this is impactful. Oh my god, how many did I pull? That's insane! I need to double check though. I'm going to double check with the foils that I've got here to make sure I didn't miss any out. Because I have a feeling I missed something out, but I could be wrong. So let's have a gander. Du -du 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 -du. Nope. Uh, nope, 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 nope. No, 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 Bound of Fury is a Platinum Rare, so we'll put him over there anyhow. Mansion, Ash Blossom, we only pulled one Ash Blossom, which is insane. Baron of Fury again, and another Baron. So there's that. So let's see, out of this one box, what was my pull rate? So we got, we got Platinum Rares, let's start with the Platinum Rare. So we got one here, uh, two. Wow, no way, there can't be just two. No way there's just two. Really? I only got two? Oh, you can't be kidding me. No way. Yeah, I only pulled... Oh, wait, there we go. There's another one. There's three. Yeah, I only pulled three. Okay, so my three uh, Platinum Rares was Pledeprant, Summon Limit, and Baron de Fjord. I think the best one is Baron de Fjord out of here, so... That's that, so we've got three of them. 
And then we got ourselves our ultimate rare, so that's one. Uh, is that two? Three. Is that three? Or is there more than that? Double check. That's a collector's rare. 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 Of a century, yeah. So, ultimate rares we only pulled three of them. So, we got Junk Speeder, Ferris, and Evacuation Device. I think the best one is either the Junk Speeder or the Ferris, depending on how you play the game. But what is insane though, we pulled one, two, three, four, five collector rares. We got ourselves Jackalope, Newmon Dragon, NC Nest. Downer Magician and the Nibiru. I think the best ones are between the Nibiru and the Downer Magician, which is absolutely amazing. But weirdly enough, though, when people say you guarantee to get three quarter of a century rares, I didn't. I only got two, which is possibly some people thinking I got scammed or I got buggered, but doesn't really matter. But I pulled myself Triple Titus Talent, which is absolutely one of my favourite cards to get, and Magician's Salvation. So I cannot complain. Am I possibly going to get myself two more boosters? I know a boost box of this. More likely, yes, I will do. But I gotta wait another time until I get another one. Either way, or I may just buy myself a few random boost packs here, there, and everywhere, and then just buy it like that. Either way, people, if you guys enjoyed today's episode, make sure you smash the like button. I think my luck was absolutely amazing. We pulled some amazing cards, definitely from my meta folder, and possibly up for trades as well. With that being said, the people absolutely go to you guys subscribing, and I'll see you guys next time. Cheerio! Oh my god, my luck is now going to be on for a test. Because the next lot is Pokemon, and it is Pokemon 151. The whole lot. Oh baby. I like getting these, these are nice. I don't have a clue what the values are, but I'm sure they'll pop up right now. Ah! Ah!